Hi guys, Jono here from OptiZen. Can you edit the SEO title of tag pages in Shopify? The short answer is yes. If you know how to work with liquid code, you can do it within your liquid code. Although when you start working with lots of different tag pages, it can be quite cumbersome. Uh, the, one of the main features of our OptiZen app is the ability to change the SEO meta information within a tag page itself. And that includes the SEO title, which is one of the most important elements of a page from an SEO perspective. Just briefly, if you have worked with Shopify, you'll understand how tags work. Essentially, tags are used for many different purposes within Shopify, for navigation, for grouping products together, for filtering, etc. And when you have many tags or you tag your products with many different tags, and have many tags throughout your store, you can end up with many different tag pages. And this is all uh, all good for uh, being able to group those pages together. From an SEO perspective, the issue that it creates, if you do serve these pages, for example, you have links on your store from your menu or from other pages within your site to your tag pages, those tag pages can actually index in the search engines. By default though, what Shopify does for the SEO information on a tag page, it borrows that information by default from the main collection page. So here we have a, a main collection, saddle pads, and the tag is dressage. So all the products within this page have the tag dressage, and then Shopify is able to serve this URL uh, as a sub collection. So that works quite well to ensure you can create these pages. But then obviously, if you want to be able to optimize these pages correctly for the search engines and not have that, that duplicate information that's on the core collection page, you want to be able to change that SEO information. This is one of the main features of what OptiZen does. So for example, if you look up here, we can see uh, that if I just hover over that, it's not going to click down for me. There we go. We have the uh, SEO title actually optimized for this particular page. Then we have a H1, which is unique and optimized. Then we have our description here with uh, links in there if you want. And also the OptiZen app allows you to add content below your product grid also. So certainly by uh, uh, having this option to change your SEO title, edit your, your H1 title, your description and add internal links, etc you're then able to have truly unique and optimized tag pages. And as you look deeper into your site and start planning your site more thoroughly, the then the opportunities are essentially limitless, especially if you've got lots of products. So for example, you could think of a particular fashion item like a shirt, and then you might have a number of different colors within those shirts. So you could then have a shirt and then you, you might tag the, all the red products with the tag red and you end up with shirts slash red and you have a highly optimized uh, page for red shirts rather than having to create an entire new collection for red shirts. It goes deeper than that when you, you have your main collection for shirts and then you might have, uh, you've got your red shirts and you'll have your blue shirts and you'll have green shirts, for example, and you might have 10 or 20 different colors. You, you, you end up creating a silo uh, collection of different colored shirts. You can then internally link all those different colors together or to other relevant uh, tag pages and collections. And the search engines do like to see um, grouped or siloed uh, collections and sub collections on e-commerce stores. It's not the, the only way to do it, but it certainly works very well. And we, we can just look at this example here and we can see that um, for dressage saddle pad in this country here, Australia, we get 250 searches per month, which is not huge, but for uh, this highly niched and uh, very detailed kind of search, anybody looking for this particular term um, is in uh, pretty much in a buying mode. And if we just look in the uh, in Google here, we can see we've got all our ads, obviously. And for dressage saddle pad, this particular result here ranks number three. Now this has been created without any external links, essentially just creating this page, making sure we have some good internal links to this particular uh, tag page, and that will actually index in the search engines. 
one thing you need you do need to be aware of when you do this is um, that these tag pages can be indexed. We actually have a, a way to add tag pages to the sitemap, uh, the the, um, the H sorry the uh, uh, XML sitemap that then you can upload to Google Search Console. Because again, Shopify doesn't add, add tag pages by default into the sitemap. Uh, it's a very simple process to do, and then you can just upload that tag sitemap and just helps these pages be found. So that's essentially how you can ensure you have a unique SEO title in your tag pages and all the other meta information as well. There's a link below uh, to information on OptiZen. Uh, the free version uh, has uh, features to add content below your product grid on your standard collection pages. We'll see whether this one's actually got content. So this is the main collection here. So you can see as I changed that back, the, the SEO title and the H1, this changes to the core uh, SEO meta information that we had on this collection page. And it's different than, let's go to another one. We'll go to jumping here. And we can see that we've got a unique tag page, SEO title, description, etc. But as I was mentioning, uh, this, this one doesn't have it. Let's go and look at clothing and apparel. So we've got our main collection. So the free version of OptiZen allows you to add content below the product grid like this. You can add all your HTML uh, links, etc. And then the paid version um, allows you to do that plus have your optimized uh, SEO, sorry, your uh, the SEO information on your tag pages. So that gives you ability to be very flexible and create highly optimized collections and sub collections for your Shopify store. If you have any questions, just use the, uh, you can add a comment below or use a contact form on the OptiZen app site. Thanks. And we'll talk to you next time.